Uh, girl, I can't lie. Feel like a you, 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 watch her back it up. She do that, da, 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 What's up you guys it's dreamer dre here back at again with another video in today's video i will be transforming this hair right here ew, and putting on a wig i will be doing a review as well as showing you how i put it on i'm not really gonna be telling details this time only because i don't really know what i'm doing i'm just kind of doing what i seen on youtube before so we're gonna try it now <sighs> So I'm back with my hair already washed. I had my grandmother do my uh, braid pattern for me. Now that I have you here, I'm gonna show you guys the wig that I got. I got this wig from I See Hair on AliExpress. I wanted to test it out cause why not? I like wigs. I didn't drop that. So the box just looks like this. Uh, it gives you like how to wash it and everything on the back, how to take care of it. So when you open it up, I bought the 13 by 14 uh, frontal wig that is a 14 inch. So this is it. Uh, it says 14 on the front of the bag. It also comes with this little like bow thing this like scrunchy bow thing i don't really i'm not gonna be wearing that nor am i going to be wearing these lashes because they kind of look trash no offense but it's the thoughts that count i only wear um wild and reckless lashes obviously speaking of wild and reckless lashes they're going to have a big relaunch in august soon so get ready for that also they still have a few styles left i believe so go ahead and use my code DREA1 on uh, your checkout so you can get some money off. <laughs> uh, it also comes with this wig cap, but I don't really like this wig cap. So now that we have all the items uh, set from the box, I'm just going to show y'all the hair. This is how it looked when I uh, got it off. This uh, where I got it from. It's uh, I show body wave lace front human hair wig 30 uh, 360 lace frontal wig pre plucked. Um, this does it doesn't look pre plucked in my opinion. It says pre plucked um, three by four. I mean thirteen by four, thirteen by six lace front uh, wig Remy Brazilian hair wig. So I got the 13 by four, like I said, uh, I only got 14 in. I used to love like long hair, like really, really long hair. But as I grew up, I just really started getting out of it more. So that's why I don't have any like really like inches like that. The wig just has like this little foam thing was on the inside of it. And then it also had like the little protector over the wig. First things first about it, is that it is soft, it's very soft. It's supposed to be 150 density too. Now, I'm no wig expert, but it feels a little thin in my opinion, but it's okay, it's okay. This is how it looks on the inside. It just looks like this. Uh, you got the frontal up here, you know, 13 by four. <laughs> um, it also does come with some baby hairs. Uh, also, I don't know if you can see this up close too, but like I said, it's supposed to be pre-plucked, but it does not look pre-plucked in my opinion, so I may do some plucking. It has the comb back here along with the adjustable straps on the sides, and it also comes with two combs on the side and one comb on the front back here. So that's how everything is looking so far. <laughs> this is my first like human hair wig, so bear with me here, guys. I don't know if you can also see it on camera, but like I said, it looks a little thin. It's still cute, it's still workable. So yeah, this is what it's 
looking like and it's supposed to be body wave too so just keep that in mind but uh yeah so first things first that i want to do to this wig is i want to bleach the knot i'm going to do that uh a little off camera but so i'll come back to you when i am done bleaching the knot So one thing that I didn't say before was the shedding of the hair. When I was running my fingers through the hair, when it was dry, there was pretty much no shedding. Like, I mean, I also wasn't pulling that hard. After bleaching the knots and washing uh, the bleach off, I did run my fingers through it. And I'm pretty sure you can't tell on camera right now, but there are some uh, hairs stuck to the gloves and a few hairs in the tub. But it's not too many to the point where it's like, oh, this is a lot of shedding. Like, no. It's not that bad. This wig is actually really good. Right now, I'm just conditioning it. So I'm just going to leave it here for another 10 minutes just to give it like a full like deep condition. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to start plucking the uh, frontals. I know what you're thinking if you're buying body wave hair why would you straighten it I just wanted to see how it would take so this will be a straight style that I'm showing you but I'll also show you how it looked after I curled it too just so you know you know how it holds what it feels like <music> Thank you. 
Since the beauty stores weren't open due to COVID, I had to use a stocking, literally, as my cat. I told you guys that I was going to do a review. So here's the review. I wore this wig for about three weeks. During this time of wearing the wig, I noticed that there was a lot more shedding than what I had said before. 
but I know that you all that also wear wigs or make wigs know that when you bleach the knots that tends to make it weaker which means it's gonna you know shed a little more also the hair was a little dry in my opinion too I did put some stuff in it to keep it moisturized or keep it look nice I don't really know what to do you know this is my first human hair wig so I didn't really know but it did feel quite dry as you all have seen before I did put the makeup on my lace so that it would match with my skin tone but I think it would have been better if I didn't put the makeup on the lace just because it ended up looking a little too orange and even though my skin tone I feel that I have orange undertones they don't show that much so <laughs> next time I will definitely skip out on the makeup but you know if you need to put it on there go ahead and put it on there but I'm now learning that the brown tinted lace might actually just be able to work for my skin tone another thing about this wig is the sizing though people like to say otherwise I have a small head so I adjusted the cap to the appropriate sizing for my head though the ear tabs did irritate my ears a bit um i don't know if that's because i didn't cut you know like big enough around my ears but it it was just the lace was irritating my ears a bit especially the ear that has my industrial piercing on it because that is still technically fairly new and it's not fully healed yet so i will say that was a concern other than that i didn't really have many other problems with this wig it was great quality honestly um i just wish it was a little bit thicker because i really don't think that it felt like 150 density so oh well to that um <laughs> other than that it's a great wig uh i'll leave a link in the description down below and yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up also comment down below what other videos you want to see uh just so you know i will be doing more of these videos in the future if you want to see a more detailed way on how i put them on just let me know in the comments below don't forget to turn on your post notifications for when i do make videos because i'll surprise you i really will also follow my social medias my instagram and twitter handles are at dreamer underscore drea one my snapchat handle is hello underscore pretty 13 i will see you guys in the next video bye Girl, I can't lie. And like a you, 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 you watch her back it up. She do that.